body count lottery run it out to a solid and sturdy 30. 10 out of Haywood. Thanks to unabated gang wars. One officer down, so I guess you're all screwed. Cause the NCPD will not let that go. Got another blackout in Santo Domingo. Netrunners are at it again, poking holes in the power grid. While over in Westbrook, trauma teams scraping cyber psycho victims off the pavement. And in Pacifica, well, Pacifica is still Pacifica. This has been your man, Stan. Join me for another day in our city of dreams. Hi everyone, welcome to Cyberpunk 2077, Phantom Liberty. I was looking forward to playing this game, finally got my RTX 4090. I am expecting it to be looking pretty posh. I am going to play Ultra, the maximum one is Overdrive. But I have a feeling, or... I guess we can test it and run benchmark and have a look how it is. Okay, let's have a quick look. I'm getting around 80 FPS average. I believe we'll see the summary pretty soon. In the lower, in the one level below this, I got around 130 FPS. So we might go to the one level below this. Alright, so this game has, so we will go with this one, the Ultra, should still be looking amazing. Um, so basically I disable nudity because I'm going to post this on YouTube, clearly that's where you're watching it, and I don't want to be banned. Also, I can't remember where the nudity part was, still in gameplay. And I disabled uh, copyright music as well. Hopefully we'll be safe here. And the video will not be banned. Where was the nudity part? Just to show you where it is. Probably 
remote control interface accessibility can put subtitles just to make it easier to catch up okay i am colorblind but at the moment i left it off usually don't have issues with that interface minimap language are good that's all good. Where was it? Gameplay tutorials on. See some. Ah, here. Nudity sensor. Is that in gameplay? Yeah, okay. <clears throat> so, yeah. Nudity sensor is on. Sorry, guys and yeah i think i think we're good we're ready to go all right let begin new game starting with regular start skip ahead from phantom liberty let's just do a regular start start from the very beginning without skipping content fundability will become available once you progress through enough of the main story recommended okay we do that the right choice for players who just want to sit back and enjoy the story combat will not pose a challenge normal will be enemies will have all the tools at their disposal to take v on for the most part, only enemies at a higher level will prove significant challenging and hard. I guess we can play normal, guys. Easy is too easy. <laughs> All right. Uh, hmm. Which one are we supposed to choose? Select these life path some events and dialogue options in the game will be different depending on your choice i guess we need we will need to ch check all options but for this gameplay i guess we need to find one suitable one okay let's see roam in the badlands looting scrapyards avoiding fuel depots life on the road wasn't easy and going up in a nomad clan has its perks honestly integrity and a love of freedom qualities that few night city possess and no amount of money can buy all right street kid they say if you want to understand the streets you gotta live in them gangs fixers dolls small time pushers you're raised by them all down here, the law of the jungle dictates. The weak serve the strong. The only law in Night City you have yet to break. Alright. Might go with that one. Let's see the last one. If you leave the corporate world with their lives fused with their souls intact, you've been there. You bent the rules, exploited secrets, and weaponized information. There's no such thing as a fair game, only winners and losers. Hmm, so what do we want to be? That's very interesting, by the way. Hmm. We want the night city life. Okay, let's go with Street Kid. And yeah. All right, here is where we choose male or female. I'll play male clearly because this voice will not fit the woman. <laughs> anyway, okay, let's see how we go. Oh my goodness, we have to customize. Okay. I'm V. 
I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. Clearly, it's going to be a man's voice. We can decide if we're going to be black. Who's this? Oh my goodness. Alright, this guy looks fairly normal. Skin tone. Darker. So many options. All right, I'll go with that one. I hope no one is a uh, objection. I am colorblind. This looks nice to me. Okay, skin type. What is that? All messy. One is pretty clear. Stick to one. Hairstyle, okay. <laughs> hmm. That looks pretty good. Can we turn him? No, we can't. Okay. I like this one. No, no. Nope, nope, nope. Hmm. It's pretty good as well. That's too much. Okay, I'll stick with that one. How many we have? 51. Holy moly. Jesus, there's so many. That is badass. It's a bit messy for my style. Oh no. That's a body there. Skip too fast. Alright. My goodness. Okay, let's go back to the one I like. That would do her color. Okay. And let's see. This one seems to be fitting his his beard color. Again, I'm color blind, excuse me. This one is too dark. Let's go with this one. Okay, eyes. Oh my goodness. We need some fill some fill some eyes look. No. That looks a bit cool. No. Definitely not. Makes him look so weird like that. Oh my God, there's so many eyes here. Okay, let's. Uh, I think that one is good. Let's go again. This is one. That's his regular look. Number 10 is giving him some depth, okay. Uh, next, eye color. Give him something fierce. I like the blue one. It's cyberpunk after all. Okay, I'll go with the blue. Eyebrows. Are they changing? All right. Wait, we went back to one. It's pretty normal. Oh, we can rotate, sorry. Oh, nice. Uh, 
you can take them off. Okay, I'll say with one. It's okay. I will color. My goodness. Go with this one. Eyelash. Eyelash color, okay. That's so weird. Blue eyelashes. Okay, never mind. Nose. Yeah, what do we do with your nose, mate? Number seven. Eight looks okay, kind of straight. No. Oh my goodness. So many options, guys. What is this? Mm. I think I'll stick with that. Okay, mouth. Jesus. Gosh, you can play for hours just setting him up. Number one. All right. Jaw. Okay. Let's see if I can give him some fierce jaw. Seven. It's more squarish. What do we got? Twelve. Forward. I like that one. All right. Years. Jesus. Definitely listen well in these kind of So weird. Okay, let's go back to one. Maybe to the standard. Okay, beard. How beardy do we want it? Beard style. Unavailable? What? Okay. This one makes him look much meaner, I think. Okay, let's go through them. That's too much. So bad. It's messy. Definitely can go crazy with this. And no beard. He's definitely a handsome bloke. So this one is the unshaved part. I'm 
contemplating number three or five. Looks more mature this way. Okay, leave it like that. Speed style. Okay. Okay, we will leave it that way. Leave the color as well. We want it darker. Multi colors. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hmm. Yeah, that looks good to me. Cyberware. Oh my goodness, okay. Okay, so we got this one. This is pretty cool. I leave it with that one. I kind of like it. Facial scars, okay. Oh my goodness, no. Just leaving that uh, that's too many. Leaving just this uh, little scar, some bottle scars, facial tattoos. Oh my goodness, he looks badass. Too much, I like that. Hmm. Okay, go back to square one. I like that one. Do like this one as well. Want to keep it? All right. Piercing. I'm not a fan. It's kind of nice. Actually, really did read the platform for special designs. Okay, piercing kind of teeth. Oh my goodness. What is that? Ah. Just leave it there. Zero one. I'll leave it at zero. Eye makeup. Oh my goodness. No, thank you. Even normal lip makeup. God. Uh, cheek makeup. No. Blemishes. What does that mean? Okay, never mind. Take it off, nails, maybe because he is nippers. Oh my goodness, what is going on? 
body tattoos. All right. That's a nice snake. Okay, we're back. Oh, okay. Devilish or something. This one isn't bad. See if that body scars. Okay. Uh, next. My goodness, how many settings do we have? Points available. Oh, okay. Choose the core attributes you want to begin with. I see. Alright, seven points. What do we want? Reflexes, technical ability. Cool. What does that mean? I don't know. Each attribute contains a set of skills. Both of these skills provide different bonuses depending on your style of play. Skill level increase as you perform activities associated with them. The maximum level of skill is limited by the level of the attribute that this belongs to. Okay, technical ability. I'm a technical guy. Your techie know-how, okay. Uh, intelligence, definitely want to be intelligent. What does this mean? By determining your raw physical power and fortitude. Impressive, it improves your proficiency with shotguns, light machine guns. Plant friendly, it also enables you to open some doors by force. Okay. Is the cool determines your associated skills and stealth abilities. Efficiency with precision rifle, sniper rifle, handguns, and throwable weapons. Proves your proficiency with assault rifle, some machine guns, and blades. I assume we will start with guns, so maybe we need the cool level. Hmm. Heap of dirt, his intimidation, sort of train of dialogue choices. You're seeing me, you're proficient with smart weapons, allows you to unleash your full potential as a net runner. Access to local subnets and show off your knowledge. The net in dialogue. Hmm. Okay, I'll go with that. Next. So begins your story in Night City. Okay. We have a fingerprint. <laughs> so difficulty normal. Our name is D. Uh, we start with the street kid. They say if you want to understand the streets, you gotta leave them. Yeah, that's a street kid. All right, let's go. Waiting for uh, for me. I thought it's the loading screen. Apologies. A little anesthesia. Oh my God! We look 
damaged. There's a look badass. Do it, John. Okay. Oh, motherfucker. Everything chill, mano? Some bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. Oh, local guy. You really think somebody local will try to mug me, Pepe? Listen, V. I got a problem. Serious this time. Okay. Spin it up. Come on, spin it. What is it now? It's a uh, cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he'd bust my legs. And he don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. You in it with Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. My bro jumped the joint. Deserve the hero's welcome. I know I fuck up, V. Mm. Are we going to stand up for it? So, you're gonna help me out, V? <clears throat> okay. Uh, let's help the guy. I'll talk to Kirk. But then you're gonna owe me one. Okay, first time in Night City, pay close attention to the tutorial to learn more about basic mechanics of the game. Or, if you're already an experienced edge runner, refer to disable hints in the database at any time during the game to access tutorials, as well as read up the most important topics of Cyberpunk 2077. All right, Sitkin, thank you. On the second floor. He's so good, boy. You're saving my life, he just he. Lacks truly. Demons walk with him. Okay. Well, the stairs. Hey, where's the rest? Parking, man. Okay, I like that uh, destination location of where we need to go. Do we need to sit? No. Hey, Kirk. Want to talk? V. Been a while? Spin it. What you need? Okay, let's sit. Pepe asked me to talk you up. What, he too shot a hand over the Yetis himself? Uh, tell him I don't bite. Not yet. Hmm. What do you What's your deal? Can't even break. How's your problem? Cut him some slack, will you? You'll pay. Just need some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No, you let him off because it's me asking. Huh, you know me. I'm a man of the bids. So I need to know what I get out of it. Mm, you avoid trouble. I don't want to owe him, so let's go with this one. Kind of no in a rush cook. here. I sometimes get the impression you forget you aren't from around here. Pop in Haywood for the occasional visit, sure. But you live far, far away in Pacifica. What are you getting at? Getting at? You're probably needing to think before you start something with the local sun. Hmm. I'm open to other options. Okay, what's this? what's this? Grab a look. Mm hmm. Cream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Uh huh, and four? Number four will belong to my client, just as soon as you clep it for me, that is. Mm. 
okay. I guess we're going with this one. I don't like that one. I do this, and Pepe's dead is squared. Of course. I'm a man of my word. You know that. Whole thing simple. You swipe the ray field for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, club where our ray field driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. Soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. Just gotta grab the ray field and roll out. Simple. Who owns the ride, owns the shit plan, and your man Rick? Who's the owner? Just an Arasaka suit from across the water. Spews cash out of every hole in his body. And his name? How would I know? Why would I care? It's a hot item and I know where to find it. And your man Rick? Trust him like my own brother. Okay, let's do it. How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. This bitty bop works like the key Rayfield techs use for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. <laughs> Come on, Kirk, even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little faith. So, we all agreed then. Leave us instead, but keep your word. Okay. We are. Glad to hear it. Always said you were a bright bulb. Head to Embers in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. You two will hit it off. Good luck out there. We'll be in touch. All right, I guess we're getting out. Oh, I was at the hospital today. Malone, the game looks amazing. I'll give them that. Fuck, I take it. Two days. So, so, he laid out her nervous. They were chasing volcanoes, guys. So he had a good thing. Japanese dude? Dan there. A boxer? Standing, understand? Please. NCPD. Volcanoes got their best feet. Up, okay, this game needs uh, is a lot of collection hey, stuff. Why do I see no goddamn lemons? No goddamn lines? They're in there, for sure. Uh huh. Alright. <clears throat> Spare a veteran some change. Who talked? Where was he? This guy? Sorry, buddy. Just learning, Salute learning the, the city. The Tell them to be ready. Yes, Padre. Well, who do we have here? We. Long time. Didn't know you were around. A few weeks ago, you haven't changed a bit. It would not change a bit. Sebastian Ibarra. I haven't changed a smidge. No one calls me by my name anymore. Almost forgotten how it sounds. How are things, Padre? The same. Haywood. Nothing ever changes here. I'd rather hear about you. Yep. No place like home. Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See you got a good down-home welcome. How was it back east? Tell you later. Got something on my plate. How about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Marcus, let's go. All right. Guess we're going this way. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard it, Marcus. Gosh, this game is beautiful. Look Your at that. Your return to NC has been good? Busy already? 
Uh, two years gone by, not much has changed. You know how it would. It has strong roots, ever watered by the same blood. Now, tell me about you. She really wants to know about me. Yeah, I pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So, I'd like that didn't turn out like you expected, huh? Went there without expectation. Um. Went there without expectations, actually. Well, except that it'd be better than here. It wasn't. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. Shit. And these enemies. Stop the car. What's going on? Business. You carry it? Great, we're trying something to shoot now. Sebastian Ibarra. Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz once and for all. Got an offer for you, Patty, so listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen. Done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be? Well, Patty. One more what's... fucking word. Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you, which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Well, anything else? It seems our conversation has come to a close. Careful, Padre. Never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. Marcus, please. All right, we got interfering in this business. I guess we'll see some fighting later. I am pleased to see you have not forgotten your roots. Still have the gift. So many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Who was that? No one important. He'll be gone in a week's time. Another will come in his place. He pulled iron on you. He did. And he will pay for doing so. Gosh, it's like playing in the mob. Pull up here. Right here. I'll just drop down below. Here, before you go. Your number. Could be useful. All Maybe right. we can also work together again. Take ourselves back <clears throat> to years. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. So go with God. All right. Jumping off the bridge right away. If you like the video, I'd appreciate the thumbs up and of course subscribe for more gameplay videos to come. Thank you.